Derby Q&A on the B with Livesey's Butchers Preston. Right, so it's barbecue season. I'm here at Adrian Livesey's Butchers in Preston Market and this is all part of our barbecue Q&A. If you've not looked at it, go to our website, thebee.co.uk. This is your chance to ask a real butcher uh, exactly how to prepare your meat for the barbecue. Uh, so I'm here with Adrian. Hello, how are Hello, you doing? Hello, Mike. How are you? I'm very well. Um, we have some questions for you that have been coming in via our website okay, thank you. Uh, about what to do on the barbecue because a lot of people get a bit lost in it all. Uh, so the first is, what is the least fattiest joint of beef? The least fattiest joint of beef is the one you want it to be. You come to me and I'll personally select and we've got one or two things in the back of the fridge that might be more suited to you than what you see on here. Everything is nice and lean as uh, health says it has to be but then again, nowadays, uh, that's gone through the window and the most juicy cuts of beef are those with, with the uh, bit of fat That's in it. it, they say that's what adds the flavour isn't that's it? That's the, the flavour, the fat is the flavour. You don't have to eat it but it adds the flavour to it. Best cuts of beef is like the back end of the rump, the ribeye. Uh, Phillips a bit too expensive, I would say. It's not expensive on Preston Market, but when you come in here, you'll see things that half the price of a lot of places. Lovely. What's your favourite thing to get on that barbecue? Uh, pork. pork. Always pork, yeah, because it, it, it's it's marble meat. All pork has a bit of fat with it. So you don't have, like I say, you don't have to eat the fat, but it's good for you. It's not bad for you, you know what it is. You know, it's, it's health conscious. I tell you, I'm getting really hungry just looking at a lot of this meat. Um, this is a question that I've always wondered because in the past I have given myself food poisoning from chicken. So should you pre-cook your chicken in the oven before you put it on that barbecue? It goes on the thickness of the chicken, of course. You know, a thin slice of bread toasts faster than a thick slice of bread. Uh, that is the right, that's right, sir. <laughs> Thank you. Any time. Uh, if it's chicken legs and things like that, I do say pre-cook them, pre-roast them in the oven for a while, you know, uh, and then you can put them on the barbecue just to frazzle them off, just to finish them off so you get the nice barbecue flavour. I mean, if you're doing strips of chicken, don't even dream about doing things like that. Put them straight on the barbecue on a piece of foil, add a bit of coconut oil, something like that. Ooh. It's gorgeous, yeah. absolutely. My mouth is watering, literally. And as you saw before, markets brilliant you get banter you know you don't get that in supermarkets um so get down to adrian livesey's butchers get your questions in on the website for your chance to win some meat from here as well for your barbecue uh, so the b.co.uk is where you need to go uh, adrian thank you okay 45 years experience Keep Good it there. barbie q a on the b with livesey's butchers preston